we are given a 30-60-90 triangle named ABC. It is right angled at vertex B. Measure of angle A is 30 degrees and angle C measures 60 degrees. What do we need to prove here? We have to prove that the side opposite 30 degrees is half the length of the hypotenuse. That is, BC is equal to half AC. How do we prove that? This figure does not tell us anything. So we have to do a little bit of construction to find a way out. Let's extend CB to D like this such that BC is equal to BD. This length should be equal to this length. And then we join AD like this. Because we have extended CB, this angle also will be 90 degrees. Now let's analyze our construction. We are interested in length of BC. From our construction, we know that BC is equal to BD. It means that BC will be half of DC. So if we manage to prove DC equal to AC, we're done. In our proof, let's look at triangle ABC and triangle ABD. In these two triangles, BC is equal to BD based on our construction. BC is equal to BD. Angle ABC is equal to angle ABD as both equal 90 degrees. And AB is equal to AB because it's the common side to both the triangles. We have a side angle and side. Therefore, triangle ABC is congruent to triangle ABD by the SAS congruence condition. The corresponding parts of congruent triangles are always congruent. Angle ADB is equal to angle ACB as they are corresponding angles of congruent triangles. But we are given that angle ACB is 60 degrees. It implies that angle ADB will also be 60 degrees. Angle BAD will also be equal to angle BAC as they are corresponding angles of congruent triangles. And angle BAC is given as 30 degrees, which is why angle BAD will also equal 30 degrees. Both these angles together form angle A. So we get the measure of angle A as 60 degrees. Now look at triangle ADC. As all three angles equal 60 degrees, we can say that triangle ADC is equilateral. All sides of an equilateral triangle are equal to each other. Therefore, DC will be equal to AC. We got what we were looking for. As B is the midpoint of segment DC, DC will be equal to twice BC. This equation can be written as 2 times BC equals AC. Transposing 2 to the other side, we get BC equals half AC. In a 30-60-90 triangle, the length of the side opposite the 30 degrees angle is always half the length of the hypotenuse. Does the converse also hold true? We see that in the coming videos.